So we've, what we've created here is a, it's a new type of 3D holographic display technology and we're working closely with both Ericsson and Verizon to demonstrate what is actually possible over their cutting edge brand new 5G network. So uh, we've got two particular applications that we're demonstrating here. We've got real-time holographic video conferencing over 5G and then we've also got some medical data that we're using to explore what, what else is possible within that 5G network. So the, the sheer amount of data that we're transmitting uh, would not be possible over any other wireless protocol. Um, the 4G stuff just wouldn't cut, cut it in terms of bandwidth. Uh, but with 5G we've got more than enough uh, uh, bandwidth to, to send the data that we need. Well, it's, I mean, for our tech in particular, it, we're really bleeding edge. It's our first generation of our, 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 both our hardware and our software, and we're really just seeing what's possible. And so the, what we've got here probably, well, hopefully, is the future of 3D holographic video conferencing. I mean, when we think about it, the, the, the science fiction writers and, the, and the, everything from Star Wars to Avatar, this is the sort of technology that, that people who are not restricted by the technical limitations, when they think about what the future of communication could look like, this is the tech that they come up with. And so this, this is what we've made. So what we're demonstrating here is uh, volumetric display and communication or three-dimensional holographic communication. The premise of the demo is that we're a couple of doctors and we're reviewing a patient's medical, uh, d uh, medical imaging data together. Um, it's really exciting for a couple reasons. First of all, the holographs are uh, really interesting to look at. And then from a networking perspective, we think it's a great way to demonstrate the power of 5G's bandwidth capabilities and latency. Uh, so we're pushing uh, a lot of data, roughly four times as much data as you'd use to stream a 4K video uh, at your home. So it's a lot of information going very quickly. Um, and it's just a, a neat futuristic look at what's possible, what starts to be unlocked with 5G.